record-setting day for Trackhouse Racing and for Ross Chastain. He's standing by with Q. That's right, Rick. And this team celebrating almost like it was a race win. I can see the emotion in your face, Ross. First career pole in the Cup Series for you, the first for Trackhouse. What does this mean for the organization and for tomorrow's race? Uh, it's it's so much bigger than just one race or or just getting you know first pit stall and and everything for Nashville and where Trackhouse was born and and started out of out of Broadway with Tootsie's and, and Justin and everybody. Um, but it's just so much personally, so much agony in qualifying my entire life. I've never tied together laps like the car was capable of. I've always left the time out there and just to to back up my time from round one to round two was the goal and. Like, I just, I, like, so much, I don't, I don't know how to describe it, but so much, like, personal frustration with myself over the years and then going to work for over a decade now in the sport to try to qualify better, um, it's just hasn't shown results, Kim. And for our Worldwide Express team, it's all about results and shipping things faster than everybody else and better. So it's uh, awesome for the team. Um, I hate Daniel tore his, his up. Uh, it's super, super slick down there. but. Um, personally, just a lot of a lot of um, personal validation that, that the things we're doing are right. Ross seeing the fruits of his labor finally, wiping some tears off his eyes after that pole-winning effort. They will lead the field to green here tomorrow. Emotional day for Trackhouse Racing as Justin Marks just moments ago finished third in Mid Ohio in a Trans Am. So a very good day for Trackhouse Racing. Congratulations, Ross Chastain.